Hey guys, it's Ron from NextZen. Behind me is a Mercedes with the matte finish on it. Uh, these can be troublesome when you're applying any of the NextZen ceramic products. We're gonna show you a proper way to do it and uh, give you some tips and tricks here. All right, so we're gonna start off with a fresh box or kit of Elite here. Open this up and uh, you'll see inside, in case you've never purchased uh, an Elite yet. Um, you have some applicators inside the box and then we have our warranty cards and, uh, and the uh, product, the Elite, which is absolutely phenomenal. Now as you'll see I have this door cracked so it's not completely shut uh, and I have that door on that side open. And this is so we don't have uh, product overlapping and going on to the adjacent panel. Typically it's real easy to apply it and get it exactly where you want it. However, when you're wiping off, sometimes you might get a little bit that would wipe over into the next panel. And if you don't notice it, it's gonna create a, a high spot or a dark spot uh, after it's all done. Uh, I've got this handy little cart here and I keep my bottle on the cart and we are using a uh, uh, a little dropper here that will extract the product out uh, and this just sits in a little shelf in the bottom there so it doesn't spill while we're applying it. When you're applying this product this is the Elite and this goes for any of the next end products you're gonna want to really get this panel wet so we're gonna use a little bit more than what we would normally use uh, when we we're doing, say, a, a, a gloss finished vehicle. So we're going to want to get this on pretty wet. And so there's our uh, initial application on the applicator here. And so I'm just going to kind of start in the center or the upper, upper portion of this door and I'm going to start applying it. And this product is really thick. So we're going to come through and, and just start bringing it up and down. I'm going to kind of frame this door out a little bit. But the goal is to keep it wet. You don't want to let this flash off or uh, start to uh, rainbow on you. I'm going to put a little bit more on here just to help it along. And you'll notice that it's, it's a little chilly in here today. It's uh, probably 68 degrees in the shop today. It's uh, a winter day here. I'm gonna just get this on and I wanna do this whole panel. So I wanna get this whole panel applied. I don't wanna have any dry spots. Add a little bit more here. Get this top section up here. I wanna make sure I have everything nice and wet with the product, door handles, everywhere. If you uh, have areas that get dry on you and you try to buff it off, then uh, you may end up with uh, streakiness in your finish. And it'll really be hard to correct because you can't polish these. So I'm gonna grab two low nap microfiber towels and I'm just gonna start kind of wiping this and you're gonna have to flip them. So I'm gonna take the first one and just come through and I'm doing an initial wipe. Again, you don't wanna let this flash and uh, start to rainbow on you. So we'll flip this over and now I'm just gonna give it a good buffing here. And I see I got a little bit on this panel over here still, even with the door open. Get down on the bottom. And that looks pretty good. We can take a light, an inspection light, and 
inspect it if we like. You have to kind of hold the light at angles and we're gonna look for any, any spots that we may have missed during our application. If you find you're running into some areas that might be a little heavy, you can always grab a wet towel that has distilled or reverse osmosis. You don't want to use tap water. And you can take this towel and give it a quick little wet wipe. You'll see the water, the little bit of water on here beating up. And then come back and just buff it. Obviously, we're not going to buff it to a shine. And this will help when you get your, uh, uh, any excess over on your adjacent panels. So come through and give it a quick little wet wipe here. We have our bucket of distilled water. And now we have the coating on here. It's nice and even. We don't have a, a bunch of streakiness to it or high spots and we can move on to our next panel. All right, for big panels, it's uh, probably best to work as a team. Um, and we'll show you what we do here. We're gonna, again, put a liberal amount of the Elite on the applicator here. And I'm gonna start, and Chase is gonna follow me. So I'm gonna kinda lay a strip down the center here and then I'm gonna go back and forth. And you can't move really fast with this coating because again, it's, it's good and thick. So you're gonna to have to just take nice, long, even strokes here. And we're gonna do this whole panel in one shot. We're not gonna break it up. We wanna get it all on here. We wanna keep it wet. Let me get a little bit more on here. We'll get this section started. making sure that we have plenty of product on here. And I'm kind of taking it to this hump or this body line right here. And I can see it starting to dry out in some areas. And now Chase is gonna start buffing the excess off and I'm just gonna keep applying it. He's gonna slowly follow me across this hood. And this is a this is a big big hood, so and I'm taking it on all the way over to the other side here to this other body line in the hood. And this is paint protection film, so it it's gonna go on the same way it goes on this. This matte film is going to go on the same way it goes on the matte paint and you'll have the same issues if you don't follow these procedures that you would on this as if you were doing it on the paint. And if you have to stop and help your partner level anything out, by all means do so. you do see some streaking or some high spots, you can come back with your wet applicator and reapply it and kind of activate what's already on there and come back and buff it off. And we're two thirds of the way through this. we have success here. I hope this helps you out on your next matte uh, finish application with any of the next Zen products from 365 Pro to the Professional, Graphene, or the brand new Elite.